Hello everyone, welcome back to the next episode of the Let's Play series. So, we're here, uh, carrying on with the Ledger main story, as usual. I di haven't really done anything since I last played on the last episode, so, yep. We're gonna go to Natatorium. This has really, really annoying, uh, uh, puzzles, puzzle sort of thing. You'll see what I mean. Um, but first of all, we're gonna do some other quests which aren't so bad, so... Yeah, it says uh, we shouldn't have the right to be here, so basically first we need to go to um, Arkangrove uh, that we can talk to Raced, and then we'll be eventually uh, able to talk to that person. We basically just have to do a quest here uh, that goes right to that person, and then we just do a quest from uh, them to turn it in or something like that. So yeah, gonna accept that. As you can see, it was like last episode, if you remember, Sorry if I wasn't clear just then. Basically, last episode we did the same thing. Um, we had to go to Raced and then go to find the person and then it would auto turn in and then we could start accepting quests from that person. I don't know why they did that, but it's a bit, little bit of a waste of time anyway because we know where they are since we just have this map to help us out. So yeah, now we're going to go there and uh, it's going to turn in on its own and we have to wait a little bit. And yeah, we got Akangro of rank 5. Okay, so now we're going to click on Nis. Sorry if I said it wrong, I don't really know how to say it here. So yeah, we're going to click on quests and dive right in. So yeah, you want to accept the quest and now uh, I think you just have to kill monsters, but I'm not completely sure guys. Uh, it wasn't really clear in the quest, if you can uh, see with me over here. Um, it doesn't really say, uh, gather 12 corrupted corals that appeared abundantly. That means that we have to, oh, we don't have to fight monsters. Okay, I know what we have to do. Basically... Uh, we have to c go over these corals. We actually have to walk over them, by the way. Um, and if you are following me through, just keep in mind some of them are really annoying to get. So, for example, there's one here right next to the uh, draconian thing. So you want to just click here so you can walk over it. And uh, you want to go over this one as well. Now we're going to go through the next room and do the same for wherever we find. Um, it's going to be scattered everywhere. So this is the annoying thing I was talking about, by the way, guys. Um, it's really annoying to get this to work. I'll, I'll have to uh, experiment. Um, so yeah, I'll explain this afterwards. For now, we'll carry on with this quest. Uh, yeah, so we've done it in this room, that room, and the room after. We're going to have to ex try and go through the other rooms. Um, this is the gate to the boss, similar to the last one. A uh, similar type of thing. So yeah. We're going to go to the left and just walk over the quarrels, or not quarrels, corals. Um, also guys, you might uh, notice that there's a difference in the mic. I'm just testing this out. If you really don't like it, then let me know. Um, if you don't mind it, then I'm probably going to stick to it because it's a lot easier, uh, more convenient for me. But yeah, I've done this uh, experiment in the past, but you've said it's really bad. But this one is a different one, so I'm just checking this out. So yeah, now we complete the quest. You want to go and turn it in quests and turn in so now for the next quest is seafood diet we need to kill the angler angler fish 20 times which is going to be a, a big headache but yeah guys um basically you want to kill this one over here oh, i've got someone to help me here which is nice but yeah i'll be back once i've killed 20 angler fishes all right guys we uh just completed that so what we're going to do is go back and turn it in Okay, for the next quest, we're going to click on Mercenaries, and we need to kill 15 of the uh, Draconians over here. Yes, a lot of time here, guys. Uh, I don't know if I can, uh, after I defeat the boss in this area, I don't know if I'm going to carry on the episode, but yeah, it's going to be a while, um, especially the puzzle thing. So, yeah, guys, you want to kill this guy? Um, for me, it's just a bit of a hassle, um, because my class doesn't do that much damage. I mean... It does a good amount, but it doesn't. You're watching it now and it's creating, but when I was doing the other things, uh, it was taking very long. So, yeah, I'll be back, guys, once I've done this. Alright, guys, we uh, completed that one, so we're gonna go turn it in. I actually switched the pirate class and enhanced everything up, and it's been really smooth. Um, I was able to kill them super fast, uh, which was nice. And, yeah, so what I want to say about Pirate Class is that um, it's seasonal on the TLAPD event, which is coming in the 20th of September or 19th, I'm pretty sure. So if you want to get the Pirate Class, you have to uh, do slash join Blazebeard, 
uh, on the TLAPD event time and you can get it. I don't think you can get it right now. If you can, look on the wiki, but that's as far as I know is what you do. Um, if you can get it at any time, then you can, but that's all I know. So yeah, now you want to go turn it in and we're going to go to synchronize slaying. So basically, um, wait, this isn't the one. Uh, travel to cloister okay yeah, so we have to do some other thing first before we do the puzzle uh, this isn't too bad so uh, we need to go to the uh, different places so I'm just gonna go on the map it's really easy so story and first of all we're gonna go to Arkangrove and kill the gorilla fence um, over here on the right or the left whichever way you wanna go uh, it's probably on the other side but oh well we'll keep going around so yeah there's a lot of AFKs over there so I'm just I'm probably not gonna cut the video here because it's not gonna be that much farming. So yeah, guys, um, let me know what you think of the Let's Play series about this mic. Um, even if the old one's better, if this one isn't bad, then just let me know. And uh, yeah, so this is quite easy, but I'm just scared about the next part kind of because uh, it's really annoying to do. I remember trying to do it before or doing it before, but it's just a bit of a headache. But at least that would be uh, nearly the last quest. Not, not. I mean, nearly the last puzzle. There's one more in Gilead, I'm pretty sure. But other than that, there's no more puzzles. So, yeah. Um, it's a little bit fun, I guess. It's not too bad. It's just, um, it's a bit buggy sometimes. So now we're gonna go to our quests and see what we need to do next. Uh, we killed the gorilla fins and seed splitters. Okay, we already did that one. Then travel to the cloister and bring me four stag horns. So the cloister, um, maybe we'll just type it in. Slash join cloister. Um, hopefully that's spelt right. Yep. So we need to kill stag horns. I think we get it from the other guys. Uh, let's try killing both and see which one was the right one. So yeah, pirate class is actually really nice. Um, it takes them down really quick. And you have a chance of getting health on your third ability like uh, heal over time so uh, it's pretty good for soloing if you get lucky um, it does a really nice damage as well so yeah I'm just gonna kill four of these guys uh, I also switched the burning blade so I could do extra damage so yeah yeah guys sorry I'm not getting that much done in each episode but uh, yeah it's, it's quite time consuming if you were to see how many minutes it actually takes to record this is actually crazy and then all I do after is cut out the boring uh, parts where I'm just hitting the monsters and then I compile everything together so yep uh, it's a lot a lot harder than it looks I guess I could say that so uh, we're gonna keep going with this guy uh, we only need to go one more of these there we go so we did that one now we need to go to the next one which is C fan gonna try and figure out where that is uh, by clicking on quests and reading it Karasu oh wait they do drop one of the things okay let's see if it drops from this guy now please drop oh yeah I was farming for the uh, blade the other item on stream uh, the 1% drop rate for three hours and it didn't drop which was so annoying. It's like today I'm getting super unlucky with everything. Like, it's crazy. But it's all good. Um, so, yeah. Uh, we, it's just not dropping off this guy. Hopefully it drops. Otherwise, it might not be the right thing. Even though it says to kill this. Ah, uh, This sort of thing really annoys me sometimes. Like, at least drop once so I know, you know. It's a bit, it's a bit dodgy at this rate. It's saying that this drops C fans. If it doesn't, then it's just weird. I'm gonna double check the quest. Three C fans from the Karasu, so it must drop it. So why isn't it dropping it? Come on, dude. Um. <sighs> And we also have to kill the boss in this area as well, which is really annoying. It's probably not going to be 100% drop rate. This is probably one of the most annoying episodes to film. It's not even dropping. Ah, <laughs> oh, this is going to be a while, guys. 
Come on, Karasu, you know you wanna drop it. Alright guys, we got it eventually. It only drops from this guy for some reason. Anyway, um, we're gonna go up here. Oh wait, this is not the right place. Uh, we're gonna go to um, the boss. I don't even know where he is anymore. I think he's this way. You basically have to keep heading upwards. Uh, yeah, he's over here. As you can see, um, easy way to tell uh, which uh, that you're in the right room is that uh, there's a little bit of light coming up from outside here. So yeah, it's Windigo. I'm just going to beat him up real quick. Hopefully, uh, it's only a one drop, but I hope it's actually a one drop instead of it being a uh, countless times where he doesn't drop it. So that would be kind of annoying, but yeah. This class is pretty nice overall. I'd really recommend it uh, when it's available to get. Um, it might be available all the time now. They may have changed it, but as far as I'm aware, it's not. Okay, so yeah, it was a easy, easy kill, easy kill, and easy drop. So we're gonna slash join. Um, I think it's Mudluck that we need to go to. Just type that in real quick, and we're gonna go down here. And we actually need to kill the. I think it's the other type. Swamp Lurker. So we need to kill these guys um, six times, I think. I wish it, uh, the last skill of pirates was a uh, AOE. The it's like a one. One uh, monster only, even though it's a really huge animation. It's kind of weird. Um, as you can see, look, it's like sh it's a barrage, and it's only for one thing. That's kind of crazy. Anyways, um, we're gonna keep going with these guys. All right, guys, we're done with the quest. Now we're gonna slash join. Actually, I don't want to type natatorium. It's a bit of a pain to type that in. Um, anyway. Yeah, we're gonna go here. I'm um, just being a bit lazy there, and yeah, we're gonna turn this quest in. Now we are going to open the gate with the uh, what's it called? With the uh, puzzle. There we go. Sorry, guys. So yeah, um, basically what we need to do is move this statue onto this circle over here. So we do this by um, highlighting over these, and there's actually some wind thing going out there. So as you can see, I press that one, and as you can see, the seal has been activated. So now, once you've done that, you don't want to step on these again, just in case you move it out of place. So that one was quite easy, but for the rest of them, well, some of them, or one of them, I can't even remember, guys, uh, are really tricky. So basically, you just do this, and you just experiment um, with how it goes. As you can see, I failed that one. So um, we're going to restart over here. Um, we're gonna, whoops, we're gonna try and do this again. So as you can see, we've done one of them. Um, as you can see, I'm gonna try and okay, that's gone way too far. What does this one do? Okay, this pushes it down. So basically, we have to be really fast, like next level fast. So we have to go like this and then run along, run along, and then do this. Ah, oh, no, 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 no. Wait, which one pushes it that way? Actually, we can't activate that one. Wait, wait. Okay, let me just try and figure this out, guys. Sorry. So we're going to push this over here. Skip that one. Push this one real quick. And then push that one. Okay, there we go. That's how you do it. So, yeah, that one was a bit annoying, but oh well. Um, seems easier. I think they changed it. It wasn't that easy before. Unless I was just crazy. Anyway, this one I'm just going to guess. So that one goes there. Okay, we missed one. I'm just going to check. Okay, so basically we need to do this. And then, oh wait, no, 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 no. I missed that again. Okay, so we go like this, this, and then this. And then whatever that does. Yep. Okay. That was quite easy. I thought I'd struggle a lot more on that. Yeah, I kind of tricked myself. I made it sound really hard, but then it was so easy. I feel uh, confused. Anyway, you want to go in here and kill Nessie. So he's got 9,000 health. Uh, very easy boss, I'd say. Alright guys, we defeated him. I uh, got lucky this time, I guess. So I turned it in, and now it's going to have a cutscene. We're just going to spam the next button, guys. Oh, we got the staff. Let's go. Easy. We're going to swim away, and Nessie's going to chase us. And then Dracoth pulls him back in. Wait, that's a bit confusing. Um, okay. I don't actually understand why Dragath did that. 
Anyways, may, oh, he's against Legermain now, isn't he? Because Legermain betrayed him, sort of. Okay, so, yeah, I'm going to go home quick and quickly explain what we're going to do next episode. I'm going to hide this real quick. So, map, story, and Legermain. So, in the next episode, we're going to go to Ruins of the Great Gilead. So, that's the one with the last puzzle. Actually, the funny thing is, there's one more puzzle on this one, Legermain. Uh, but I don't think it's that hard, so. Yeah, guys, thank you for watching. Um... Please like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video and if you would like more uh, to come. And yeah, I'll see you in the next one. Thank you for watching.